Hello everybody, my name is Yona and this is Cabojiro Draws. And as you can see, it's my Artist Alley Austria Comic Con convention vlog. I was gonna actually film these talky bits at the con, but since it was so loud and so noisy, the only way for me to properly do it is to do it now afterwards. I wrote a list of things I wanted to say and in no order here, just some observations I had at the con. Number one is that due to Corona, fewer people were there, not surprising. Also, fewer people had money to buy things, which is totally understandable, but it just made for a slower con weekend. Number two being that just because there's a global pandemic going around does not mean that men will wash their hands in the men's restroom. It's disgusting. And number three being that commissions aren't really going well, so anything that people do custom, doesn't sell well, but things like my Tombola and mystery bags went really, really well. I managed to sell so many mystery bags full of art from 2016, which I actually thought I'd already have to get rid of at some point, but it worked out super well and I managed to sell a few of those. So that was really surprising. Officially the con has actually already started but there's nothing every artist is setting up because they have it that VIP people can get in at 9.15 and normal people at 10 but at 9.15 the VIPs don't go to the artist alley so we have an extra hour. I find it really funny that for the first two and a half hours I didn't sell a single thing, nobody was here. But now in like half an hour I made so many sales, like over a hundred bucks just from like every few minutes somebody being here and now again nobody's here again. So it's just really in waves and then you wait for ages, get really sad and suddenly a burst of people come. It's so unpredictable. In no particular order, here are the cosplays I saw at the con that I really liked. This entire video is somehow a top two, top three list. So also here are the top three things people told me during the con. Since my art style is inspired by ukiyo-e woodblock prints, a guy came up to me, ah, Japanese style, Bushido, and walked off. Bushido is not the right term here, and I'm not gonna go into a long Japanese explanation why, but also I didn't even draw a single samurai or something like that, so I'm not quite sure where they got that, I'm pretty sure they don't know what that word actually means, but that's okay. Number two is a guy who came up with a huge sign saying, Boku no Pico is not a hentai, change my mind. Because the change my mind meme was going around and it's a joke apparently. But that was fun to see. And number three, being all the people who come up and go like, ooh, did you draw these? And I'm like, yes, I did. You're very good. This is very unique. Then they slowly open their bag, they slowly pull out their wallet, and then they quickly walk off. <laughs> I don't understand why they do that. I'm like, yes, it's great when people compliment my art and I'm happy even if they don't buy anything. But the whole, this is great, they talk to me, they pull out their wallet and then they walk off. Could they have done that afterwards? I don't know, it confused me, so there is that. It's 5 p.m. The con is 
over. I get to take everything down now and then I'll see you in the train. A quick story from the end of the con is how all of us artists took the train at 6.07 because we had to, the con, was over at the con was over at five, we packed our stuff and at 6.07 directly from the convention center is a train to the main train station of the city Wales just to get there in time. So we're there, it's pouring rain, but it's fine since we're under this one hut and we're waiting and it's 6.07, no train in sight. It's 6.10. It's 6.15 and at 6.20 I decide I'm one of the few people here who speak German because there was a lot of international artists. I'd get out my phone and I'd call the hotline. And I'm like, hi, there's like 30 artists here, it's pouring rain, where is the train? The train's cancelled. Good, didn't say that online, didn't say that on any of like the notifications that we normally get from the Austrian train service. And like, there's a bus coming. When is a bus coming? She doesn't know where is the bus gonna stop. There's no train, uh, no street close to the tracks. She doesn't know. So all of us artists waited half an hour in the pouring rain and we just walked all the way to the train station for over half an hour and got completely soaked. But we made it in time for our next connection train, so there's that. In no particular order, here are a few of the artists you should go support, which are friends of mine who are also at the con and they have online stores or Instagram accounts. I'll link them all below, but here's those. That's all I have time for for today's vlog. I'm filming this on my new Sony ZV-1. I'm doing it in my yard just to test out how it works and if the microphone works. I hope you like it. You'll see an unboxing for this camera in next week's studio vlog. I hope you stick around until then. To see that, it would be great if you could subscribe and like and comment and all of that stuff. It means the world to me. And I'll see you then. I'm actually running late for the Creators Camp, which is a media event I'm moderating here in Austria. And I'll probably put snippets in it for the next studio vlog as well. So yeah, I'll see you then. Bye-bye.